pretty soon we will have a lot of Doctor Who content to talk about and I do apologise that I haven't been uploading videos centred around the Hooniverse for a while. That will change. You can expect to see episode reviews, rankings, all that jazz. But today I did see an article that sparked my interest and it is to do with the 8th Doctor and a potential spin-off we may be getting with him. Now, I am a fan of the TV movie. It is not perfect by any stretch of the imagination, but it is definitely a comfort watch. The soundtrack is fire though, some of the best music ever. In a dream, listen to it now, you won't regret it. Paul McGann deserves at least a couple of seasons with him being the 8th Doctor again, going on all these adventures, but without further ado, let's get into the article. Paul McGann set to make comeback as the 8th Doctor in new Doctor Who spin-off series. Doctor Who returns later this month with three specials celebrating the 60th anniversary with David Tennant back as the Doctor and Catherine Tate as Donna Noble and now Paul McGann is set to make his comeback too. Paul McGann is set to make a comeback as the 8th Doctor in a new Doctor Who spin-off series. The 63 year old actor had the keys to the TARDIS for the 1996 television film, a co-production between BBC Worldwide and Universal Studios which was an attempt to revive the sci-fi show after it was cancelled in 1989. His incarnation of the Time Lord has built up a loyal fan base since, due to the audio adventures he has voiced. He has had just two TV appearances in the 50th anniversary special and a cameo in Jodie Whittaker's final outing, The Power of the Doctor. The show is about to enter a new era with Russell T Davies, the man who rebooted it in 2005. At the helm and Disney co-producing with the BBC and spin-offs are being planned to increase the Hooniverse. The spin-offs will work in the same way that Disney created series for Star Wars and the Marvel Cinematic Universe that stream on Disney+. Plus. A source said, Russell likes the idea of bringing back McGann with his own set of episodes in the TARDIS. Disney are on board as they want more original content and want to fully exploit the franchise as they know how big it could become. Other possible spin-offs include a series on UNIT, the Earth-based military wing that works with the Doctor to defend the planet, and a villain anthology. Doctor Who returns later this month with three specials celebrating the 60th anniversary with David Tennant back as the Doctor and Catherine Tate as Donna Noble. Shooty Gatwa is then taking control of the TARDIS in 2024. Speaking in an interview recently, Paul said he would be interested, adding, I finally got to be in an episode. The fans tell me that they hope there'll be a chance for some more. That would be nice. I would be well up for it. A spokesperson for Doctor Who declined to comment. I will say that the potential of this actually being true has never been more likely than it is now, not just because of the fact that the Doctor Who spokesperson refused to comment, there are ways to explain that away, but because as the article states, Russell has always said that he wants to build a proper shared universe with all these different shows set in the Hooniverse. He tried that back in the day with the Sarah Jane Adventures and Torchwood spinning off of the parent show and it was great but the whole concept has since changed with inventions like the MCU and streaming. What better way to kick it off than to fill in the massive gap in the universe surrounding the 8th Doctor? Sure you have the big finished stories but normies wouldn't have listened to those and even those who have would still want more on screen adventures as do I. I have been saying this for years, get Paul McGann and make a whole bunch of stories to fill in that missing time. Now my ideas do go further than that and I think the likelihood of them doing what I'm about to propose is so slim. But anyway here is what I think would properly do him justice. Get 90s television equipment and film it as if it was made way back then and in the scripts include all the corny tropes that we bash on today. I know they will probably just use modern cameras and effects and it ain't the end of the world but in my opinion what I just proposed would make it 10 times better. Tell me what you think about this in the comment section down below. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.